Star Force officer Derek McManus was on a routine job to arrest a known fraudster, Tony Grosser. Accompanied by four other Star Force members and another policeman with a camera filming the footage you're now watching, they were to arrest Grosser because he failed to show up at court. The police, Mr. Grosser, open up, please. But within minutes of arriving at Grosser's property, the routine arrest turned sour and Derek's life would change forever. What eventuated was, and still is, South Australia's biggest siege. Within minutes of arriving, McManus was gunned down. Over the next 40 hours, 2,000 rounds were fired. You've approached the house, and within five seconds, you're hit with 14 bullets. But one other hero in this story was Dr. Bill Griggs from here, the Royal Adelaide Hospital. Dr. Bill Griggs would eventually come to the aid of Derek and would spend 10 minutes by Derek's side as round after round of bullets flew over his head. I think Derek was one of the sickest patients I've ever had to look after. He's actually survived. Um, I've seen a number of other people whose heart was stopped. Derek came very close to that and I think if he actually stopped we would have struggled to get it going again. He really had uh, no recordable blood pressure. I couldn't feel a pulse anywhere. I, when I initially saw him, he was white as a sheet and I really thought he was dead. It was only when he took a, a sort of last gasping breath that I thought he's, he's, he's right on the edge. He hasn't quite gone yet and uh, maybe we can, uh, we can do something. He almost lost all his blood. Uh, I still actually don't know how he survives. He's an incredible human being.